We have over 30 scientists engaged in ongoing projects here at any given time. This is Dr. Myers, our lead entomologist. Doctor, would you mind telling us a little bit about your research? Yes. I'm studying an asexual, fast reproducing insect responsible for the devastation of numerous off-world crops. A space bug. Right, space bugs. However, for the purposes of my research, I refer to them as R75. Now, the fact that these insects have only manifested themselves on planets recently visited by priors makes their analysis a top priority. Is there anything to indicate that this is more than mere coincidence? No, not yet. Now, our initial research proved incredibly challenging due to the short lifespans of the R75 specimens until we succeeded in dramatically increasing their life cycles by depriving them of sustenance. They feed and they die within a matter of hours. They starve and they live. So far, it's been three days and counting. Would you stop that, please? A bit lethargic, aren't they? <clears throat> They're nocturnal. No. They function during the daylight. They just prefer the darkness. They spend most of their time burrowing underground, consuming crops from the roots of it. Now, R-75 also displays a rather interesting defense mechanism, which we're still in the process of studying. Observe. Echolocation. Exactly. I theorize they use it to detect their enemies, such as birds, for instance. All right. Thank you, Dr. Myers. Let's move on. Well, uh, I'm not done yet. We get the idea. Thanks. Our next stop is Dr. Sharma, our lead botanist. Wait, you know, Pullman, if I wasn't such a patient man, I swear. Oh, my God. Say, Colonel, the scope of the facility has surpassed my expectations. Yes, quite remarkable. For my part, I'm somewhat disappointed. I was hoping the tour would be a little more thorough. The Gamma site is a US military facility, Miss Shannon. Access to some of the more sensitive areas is restricted. <laughs> Dr. Myers, <laughs> are you OK? <laughs> R-75 breached containment, and we had to exercise a disposal protocol. But Dr. Myers was bitten, but he went to the infirmary to get checked out, and didn't find anything wrong with them. How the hell did the bugs breach containment? Well, Dr. Myers thinks he may have triggered some sort of massive reproduction cycle after feeding them a piece of meatloaf. Wait a minute. R-75 is omnivorous? Carnivorous, actually. They seem to have lost their taste for plants. The representatives are getting a little anxious. I'm afraid I'm going to have to insist that we be permitted to return to Earth as scheduled. I'm sorry, Mr. Woolsey. No one's going anywhere. This base is under lockdown until we can establish the source of Dr. Meyer's condition. Where's he going? Back to Earth, where he'll be quarantined. He gets to go back? We don't have the medical facilities for this. If we don't send him back, he could die. I am sorry. This is totally unacceptable. The Pentagon will be hearing from the IOA about this, and you can be certain your name will be mentioned, Colonel. 